I think we need to be candid with voters. I think we have to tell them what we're going to do and what it's going to cost. What Joe forgets to say is when you leave the current system as it is, what you are talking about are workers paying, to, on average, 20 percent of their incomes for health care. That is insane. What I don't agree with is that we sh his position on health care. Look, we've talked about health care for all in this country for over 100 years. Now is the time to take on the greed and corruption of the health care industry, of the drug companies, and finally provide health care to all through a Medicare for all single payer program. Can, it won't be easy, but that is what we have to do. Again, I think it is much better to build on the Affordable Care Act. Medicare for all, which will guarantee comprehensive health care to every man, woman, and child, will cost substantially less than the status quo. You have to show how you're going to pay for it. On the Medicare for all, one of the provisions we have to pay for it is a 4% tax on income exempting the first $29,000. So the average family in America that today makes $60,000 would pay $1,200 a year compared to that family paying $12,000 a year.